Hi everyone and welcome to the James Island Charter High School 2020 ninth grade summer reading bingo book club. My name is Megan Barbie. I teach ninth grade English at James Island and I'm going to be the main moderator of the book club and someone you can go to if you have any questions over the summer. The purpose of this video is to go over the important things you need to know in order to participate in the book club. If you need to look at any of the pages in depth, I've also linked the slideshow to this welcome announcement, so you're able to go back and look and click on any links. We'll start with an overview of the presentation, where I've listed the major categories covered in the slideshow. When should you read? How do you participate and how will you be graded? How do you claim bingo and what are the prizes? Who are the moderators and how can you learn a little bit more about these books we'll be reading this summer? So we'll start with when should you read? The four books we'll be reading and discussing are listed on the right side with the dates we'll be discussing them. You should choose at least one book, but you're required or you're welcome to read and discuss as many as you like. Discussions for each book will occur during the two week frames. It's definitely best to discuss those books in the time periods given, but you're welcome to post and respond to other people's posts outside of those two weeks. If you do decide to stay in the two week time frame, you should aim to read about 20 to 25 pages per day. And it's a great idea also to mark these dates down in your calendar so that you're not missing out on any of the good discussion. Next is how do you participate? And you'll participate through two major ways. One, your discussion posts, and two, your creative pieces. So you see here that you need to do at least three original posts and two responses to posts from your peers. Your moderators will post questions to the Google Classroom page every Tuesday and Thursday. I would also mark those dates down in your calendar uh, for the books that you're interested in discussing. You do not have to make all of your posts for the same book. For example, you could write one post for Black Enough, one post for Hey Kiddo, and one for Educated. You can spread your posts out however you wish, just know that the discussion will be more meaningful if you're posting in the two-week frame for your book. And yes, you can definitely post more than three responses and respond to more than two of your peers. So that's all about the discussion component of your participation. The second way you'll participate is through your creative pieces, which is probably one of the draws that brought you to this book club. Um, a lot of the times for summer reading, you're given one book and you're told to write an essay. Um, no essays here, peeps. Um, you should have seen, received a bingo board upon joining the Google Classroom page and the options for your creative pieces are typed in blue. You only need to submit two, but the more you submit, the more likely you are to win prizes, which we'll discuss next. Don't worry, don't worry. Uh, rules for claiming bingo are listed on your bingo template. Um, just view the rubric attached to the welcome announcement to see how those pieces will be graded. So if you go to our Google Classroom page, this is our welcome announcement here, and there's the bingo rubric there. Um, finally, you can get extra credit by participating in virtual discussions on the last day of each two week time frame. Again, a great thing to mark in your planner. All right, here we go. The fun part, bingo prizes. <laughs> I would recommend printing your bingo card so that you can mark on it and keeping it in a place that you won't lose it. For each piece that you submit, you want to write the date on the bingo spot. And when you're done with the piece, you will submit it here to this assignment called Creative Pieces. Um, so for each piece you submit, you write the date on your bingo spot and then you comment on the welcome announcement when you believe you have bingo by 5 p.m. each Saturday. Prizes range from $15 to $25 and they'll be announced each Saturday evening. 
They include gift cards from Chick-fil-A, Starbucks, Paisano's Pizzeria, Black Magic Cafe, Uber Eats, and McKevlin Surf Shop. And all prizes will be distributed within a week of announcement. We also have grand prizes, and these will be awarded at the very end of the book club to those who submit the most tasks that are also the best quality. Those will be announced Sunday, August 16th and distributed within a week, so definitely mark your calendars for that one. First prize is a $100 gift card to Coastal Expeditions, which offers kayaking, paddleboarding, and eco tours to wildlife refugees and more. Second place prize is a $45 gift card to Wild Blue Ropes Course, and that's enough to cover the cost of their challenge course. Finally, third place prize is a $36 gift card to Trophy Lakes on Johns Island, which will grant you two tickets to the Aqua Park. So lots of outdoor fun to be had after spending months inside for the quarantine. A little information about your moderators. These are the people working behind the scenes to make sure the book club runs smoothly. They are staff and teachers at James Island who will post and respond to questions about the books, grade your discussions and your creative pieces, announce prizes, and monitor online etiquette. You can learn a little bit more about your moderators on the Meet Your Mods attachment um, on the welcome announcement. All right, so you're ready to join, but you're not really sure which book to pick or how to get them. Amazon's the best way to order physical copies of the books and they can get them shipped to you in as little as two days. You can check books out through the Charleston County Public Library, who is also running a book club event of their own with prizes. I would highly recommend using Sora, which is a free audiobook app offered through the JI Library, and you can email me to get an account and start reading immediately. On this page, I've included trailers for each book if you'd like to learn a little bit more about them before committing. Um, there was no official trailer for Dreamland, but I've included an interview with the author to give you a little bit more information. I've personally read all of these books, so I can assist you in picking one that best fits your interests if you do need help. Just click on the play button to view each video, and you can press the window icon on the bottom right uh, to make it larger. All right, that's all I've got for you folks. If you still have questions or want to sign up for an audiobook account, email me at Megan E underscore Barbie at charleston.k12.sc.us. And make sure you do include the E for my middle initial in there. Um, not because I'm special, but because there is another Megan Barbie who teaches in CCSD and we don't want to bombard her with all of our emails. I'm so excited to launch this club, to read your discussion uh, responses, and to see all the cool things that you come up with for your creative pieces. Let's get reading!